this to change. <laughs> the tenth ring wraith. <laughs> Sunshine, lollipops, fly water. I like making traps. Look at that wolf. This looks like Kingdom of Heaven. What a camera's out of focus. Pull the string. Look out the window. The we are an army. Where are these scars? The director of Gladiator, because otherwise you wouldn't know. You're running in slow motion, how exciting! <laughs> okay, why do all cinematography have to look so desaturated and green tinted and stuff? Why not just make it natural? Like this. King of Heaven. Plus Gladiator. Plus. Any other Ridley Scott epic movie. Equals. Another epic Ridley Scott movie. But this time. It doesn't look fun. It looks boring and overdone. <laughs> I made a rhyme. I made a rhyme. Huh. Oh, Ted, would your eyes cold? No, baby. Yeah. We just scratch that edge for you. There you go. Yeah. My name is Maximus Decimus Meridius. All I want to say is. Where dreams come true. Wow. Welcome to New York. A place where you can make magically cool movies, like Enchanted or whatever. Except this one. Oh wow, I bet you never saw that coming, did you? Yawn. Is this a myth? It is not a myth. Must these stubs always criticize the movie they're dubbing off of? Sort of, maybe. Is this an illusion? Yeah. It's not an illusion. I bet you never knew how we did this. Oh, look how impressive the computer does all the is work. Is this out. my imagination? It is not your imagination. Couldn't resist. Ah! Not the beast! Ah! Oh, wait, these are bugs. They're okay. No, Kamehameha! Uh, nah, just kidding. If it was a real Kamehameha, Nicholas, it would your, kill your hair looks weird! Uh, so hey guys, I'm a sorcerer now. Yeah, right! Yeah, I guess it's kinda hard to believe where I am, because I look and act the same in pretty much every movie I'm in. Look at that metal bird. Look at- Look at Jerry Bruckheimer! I mean, he would sell out. I mean, he's a really respectable man in pirate sequels who totally made more sense than the first. Well, and couple that with the director, John Turtletap. I love that guy. She made cliche, I mean, groundbreaking of National Treasure 1 and 2. And now, you're being sucked into a world of fantasy and wondrous whimsy. I mean, who can you not resist watching this film? It totally looks awesome, and I has me in it. You look stupid, though. Oh, shut up, okay? So I wasn't cast as Gandalf, but I was too awesome for it. Yeah. Sorcerers are. They took that title from Fantasia, man. I hope the next one's called Rider Spring. And just like Prince of Persia, this is gonna be a mega smash original movie. How much effort did it take you guys to think up this movie anyway? <laughs> That's nothing compared to the $500 million budget we're blowing on it. I mean, spending properly. Maybe they can hire some actual film, like, I mean, uh, they don't need any actual filmmakers, which is good. <laughs> Hey, wait, aren't you supposed to be like 10? <laughs> a lot of steroids in the lunches these days. Aren't you supposed to be like white in the books or something? <laughs> we made Avatar, you must watch this! Hello, children, welcome to the school for the gifted. I'm Xavier, ah, I mean. Just and Fatfair was my longtime rival. I'm glad I killed him, threw him off a satellite dish. Hey, Ma, here's Brosnan's our teacher. You know, that's not surprising. Hey, white boy! Come with me. Inside. I've been sent to kill you! By whom? Yeah! Oh, jeez! Oh, 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 oh no, 006 is back. I'm looking for Bond. Wait, who just Bond? Well, yes, and happily retired too. But 006 is back, and he's oh. got gut like powers! He's after you, Bond! Well, it's up to you, kids. Get the girl, be the hero, save the day. 
won't fail you, James. Bond is a fool to think he can kill us with a bunch of meddling kids. Come and scold an eye, too. Do wits. Stay out of trouble. I've got a rash. We're really bad at this. We can't do this alone. We can't even drive. You gave me this pen. Use it well. You got it. Don't go to another movie like Narnia or something. I find you very attractive. <laughs> oh. Uh, go! Desolation. Uma Thurman. Need help, James. We can't do this alone. Oh, fine. Yeah. I'm checking out. Whoa! <laughs> Use the gadgets with care. Whoa! This movie sucks. Really? James Bond, Revenge of the Bee. Oh, Percy Jackson. Whatever, don't watch it. Yeah. Walt Disney over here. In the land of shameless CGI, neighboring the world of uncreative business-fueled video game adaptations, there is a white guy who has a puppy dog face, and is the Prince of Persia. Hey wait, there are people who are white who live in Persia. Oh yeah, Jake, then why does it have to be you? That's typical Hollywood for you. Let's get him for the names, right? Oh, so let's change the music, because whenever you use this kind of trailer music, anything can be epic with that. Let's educate the kids for once. Oh, the dagger that makes me stuff. I bet you can't for the life of you know what the plot's going to be. Because we just filter it through a machine. We don't have writers where you think we have. Do you think this is a creative business? I thought so. Doug Walker! Okay, let's smart. bring out the fifth grade level blockbuster story list. Bad guys, check. Plot MacGuffin, check. Bad guys trying to use it to destroy the world, check. Good guys have to take it somewhere and save the world with it, check. Predictable love subplot? Check. Obnoxious back-talking female lead character? Check. An abundance of computer grading and CG effects that we are so used to and yet studios still think audiences will be impressed by? Go into the mountains! Go into the mountains. I've got a sneak. Dang. Sneak through the... Yeah, no one's done this kind of shot before. Shots like that are boring already. Ow! Director! It's funny that people will pay for the same things they've seen a million times over. Well, it's just gonna make the good movies look a lot better. Mediocre punch! This feels like a bad Pirates of the Caribbean sequel in the Middle East! Oh, no! This is imaginative! Oh, sure, if it was made ten years ago. We are creative! Look, I've got the whip! So? Mm. Elizabeth! I mean, original character! Come with me! I'm surprised you're not Johnny Depp. I'm surprised you're not Orlando Bloom. Naughty. Marvel was delicious. I am evil! Yeah. Well, we have lots of fighting, lots of effects. Sort of yeah. have a story, sort of. Ah. We're totally not ripping off another movie that I produced that made buckets of money. Of course not, oh, sir, we're creative. I don't think so. Whoosh, you totally didn't see this kind of shot before. No, no, no. <laughs> totally different from this thing. More epic shots. Might as well have a robot direct this film. 300 more. Trust me, a robot directing this would make this a lot more interesting. Go figure. Epic shot. Boring. <laughs> Unnatural color grading again. Queen of the Crescent Moon. Elsa. I mean, original character. Not interesting to use, but we will still pay and people will watch them. This is me. Prince of Persia, something you haven't seen since the last time you went to watch a movie. With, with such remakes as King Kong, yeah. and now the recently announced that they're remaking Clash of the Titans, we have gone too far this time. Boom explosive! Who needs subtlety when you're not action? Oh dear goodness. Oh, I hope not. What does Ray Harryhausen know anyway? What, oh, plague? Ah, ah, ah. We've got quick cuts! Rock music! That dude from Avatar! Come on, that was a good movie! You watch this one now! Remember 300? That was awesome too! Which is why you gotta watch, watch this one! one. Ah, ah. What, why are the Burn Burning Makers? I don't know. Warner Brothers again.
and Legendary Pictures, which started out well, but now it's kind of... <laughs> okay, I'm gonna stop with that music, because anything can be epic with that music. Watch! Things like this. I don't know. Ha! This is the director of Transporter, isn't it? Hey, Fossil Plate, yay! Hey, Casino Royale! Reincarnation is not as good as people think. Keep that in mind. Oh, yes, I am ugly! Ah! Look what we can do with our camera! Me must hear it! I'm a conflicted man. My life is not worth this. Oh, hey, bullet switch! Liam, ah! Please, I'm conflicted! I don't want to kill you! Come on, dame! <laughs> Oh no, no, Medusa, okay, stop. Here's one of the things that modern filmmakers just don't understand. Okay, anyone remember the first Clash of the Titans? I wasn't too amazed by it myself, save the very entertaining special effects, but do you remember the original Medusa scene? And how it had this creepy, nightmarish quality? Most of it was shot in the shadows, and you never knew when this hideous creature would appear to turn you into stone. Own your soul? Well, that kind of subtlety's for losers, because you know how today's real filmmakers do it? First of all, what the crap is this darkness about? Bring in some lights! Okay, good. And I bet the director was all, oh, she's so freaking ugly! She Ew! Let's scribble this out. Urgh. She must be hot. Hot, 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 This is the cool thing to do these days. Yeah, hot. Hot Medusa. Woo! Next, let's pump in some estrogen and add more snake hair. Ooh! Oh, and she's cute and all, and she'll scream a little bit and be all, ah! But she'll also be cute when she does it. Yeah, right, like that will ever happen. Oh, hey. Oh. Oh. Ah! 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 Oh. <laughs> Jeepers! Ah! Ah, please! Ah! Ah! Damn! The gods! Spoon! Hey, where you going? What? What? King Kong! The Ten Commandments! How do you like my new Force Ghost outfit? Uh... The Kraken! Okay, you know what they did with this? I'll tell you, right now. So, the original one, and it's very recognizable, someone just thought, hey, let's make it more manly and awesome and huge! So they smeared over it and took the Cloverfield monster and the Rancor beast, mixed them together, and injected a lot of steroids, and voila! Something that looks like the abomination from that pointless Hulk movie by the same director. We're glad to shed a little bit of insight on Clash of the Titans. I'm probably not going to watch it because it's something not very well thought out, and, um, whatever, you can watch it if you want, it's fine. Uh... This is a bit of a different dub, since I'm so sick of seeing poorly reimagined remakes. Yes, I said poorly. Why? Because it's like drinking water. It's not tasty, but it's safe, and everyone knows it's safe. So what they say in film La La Land do is simply assemble elements and styles that were successful and mushed it together, and it just becomes this big, huge mush of watered-down, same old stuff we've seen before. Ah, <sighs> Thank you. Uh...